Today, I have a very special guest. It's going to be a lot of fun. I'll be there in a minute. He's coming. It's going to be his special favorite dessert I'm going to make for him today. He gets to see how I do it. So, are we coming in? I'm going to start with the eggs. I'm going to take four eggs and I'm going to crack them in here. One. When do you want? Any time, just come on in. Well, can, give me a second. I want to watch the show, see how it Two. unfolds. What are you making? You didn't even tell me what you're making. Custard, your favorite dessert. Mm. Three. Like a you can use um, egg yolks, but I'm using the whole egg because there's protein. This is going to be like nourishing. Because if you use the whole egg, you get the protein. You won't feel so bad about eating dessert because you're eating a whole meal, right? Because you got the whole egg here. Okay, so then we have a wire whisk, and I'm just going to beat this. I'm going to snap that. I'll be on there in a minute. So I've got four eggs in here, and I'm going to add sugar. Now, there's different kinds of sugar. I've got coconut sugar. I have sugar in the raw. I've got regular cane sugar, and I have some raw sugar. So I'm going to kind of put this in since I have this here. I'm putting a half a cup. So when you measure dry ingredients, you measure them, top them off, and I'm putting them in here. It's so simple to make this. And then I'm beating this together. So we have the eggs and the sugar. And then I'm simply going to add two cups of milk. When you use milk measure, you're going to use a liquid measuring cup. And you make sure that the level, as you see it, is eye level. So you have to bend down when you pour. <laughs> so. I'm going to pour this here and make sure it's on the line. There we go. And we're going to pour that in. This is whole milk. Try not to use light milk because you want it to be creamy. So you want mm -hmm. to use a heavy milk, right? Because you like the fat. Fat's good. So I'm pouring this in and whisking it. And that's your three ingredients. Now you can also add vanilla. Some people like almond extract, so you can use almond extract or vanilla extract. So I'm going to put a little vanilla extract in. Oops, that's going to be really good. Now here's a treat that I thought would be fun. <coughs> Cinnamon <coughs> and nutmeg. And to make it really delicious, I brought some bananas. I'm going to take banana and put that at the bottom of the cup. Do you like bananas? Love bananas. Okay. So it's a banana custard. Banana custard. Do you like cinnamon? Love it. Love cinnamon. All right. I'm recycling this, by the way. I'm big on recycling. Is it here? And here he is, Hi. Andy Dick. Nice to meet you. <laughs> Nice to have you all on the show. Nice. So look at, isn't this cool? Do you want to Creamy. stir this a little bit? Sure, sure. Okay. Now, at the bottom of this, I'm going to take some bananas, which you love, mm -hmm. and make some slices. Okay. So there's water in here? Yes. The mm -hmm. reason I put water in here is so it won't burn. Oh. This is a new thing. I mean, it's not new. It's called a bain marie in France. Oh. Which is like a... How bath. do you say it? Bain marie. Bon Marie. Yes. Now, to pour Off this... Off with her head. Ah, to pour this in. That oh, looks really? great. So we're going to put this in. Like pour it in? No, 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 no. <laughs> Not yet. We're going to put the banana in. The bananas. Because you like bananas, right? So at the bottom uh, of these, we're going to... need them, but... Do you want, I'll do some with and some without. Yeah, do half and half. Okay. There. Oh, oh, I see. Isn't this Little a good cups. idea? Each one, then you get your own individual dessert. Mm. Isn't that a good like idea? That. 
Yeah. Wait till you taste this. You're going to love it. You want me to pour them in? Start pouring them in? No, I got a better idea. Watch this. Instead of pouring that in there, I put this in here. Oh, smart. Yeah. So that way you have it's a... It's easier to pour. Right. There you go. So go ahead and pour that in. Perfect. Is that enough? Yeah, you could go um, just a tad higher. That's good. Okay. Great. And then I'll put that in. And our last one, and then the rest we'll do. Without, so, we'll do it sans banana. Since you're Oops. speaking, whoops. It's whoops. okay. Since you're speaking French so much. Oui. And then here's a plain one. Do you want to just eat these? <laughs> Fair. Okay. Wow, you, it was like perfect. Yes, and this is you're cinnamon. Good. So you can put that on top. Put it, oops, Whoops, that was a, a little too much. much. But it's I okay. Did, I, it's really yeah, good for okay. you. It's an antioxidant. Yes, it That's is. That's good. Okay, stop. I'm going to put some, well, I was going <laughs> to put Sorry. some, also nutmeg. Have you ever had fresh nutmeg? Uh -uh. Okay, let me show you. This is a nutmeg kit, and it comes, this is what a nutmeg looks like. Wow. You know, it's, smell it. It smells. Yum. That's weird. And so if you want to put that, let's, you just grate it on top. So Weird. We'll just do it comes it. with its own little grater. Isn't it cute? So cute. It's so cute. So weird and cute. Okay. So I'll just put it on two so, you know, we have different flavors. Yeah. We can, then we can taste it. This one, I end. feel like I need to scrape off. No, no, no. Up. It's really going to be good. Okay. It'll be okay. fine. That'll be mine. <laughs> okay. So then we just stick it in the oven. Want me to? You better do it. Okay. Careful. Do you want to take a look, see how we put water in here so it doesn't burn? Because it's called a what again? Bain Marie. B A I N is. Bain Marie. But it's a water bath, is basically it. It's a water and bath. I'm putting this at 400. Yes. Nope, I'm sorry, it's 350. And turn that on. And we leave this in for about, about um, 40 minutes. Well, 20, 25. Yeah. I'll be waiting on the side. Do you want a piece of banana? <laughs> okay, so we'll be right back after we get our bananas. I mean, after everything's cooked. And you can see. Welcome back. It's time to take out our custard. So I have a great helper again today. It's kind of hot. Give me a... Pot holder, pot holder, here. Oh, pot holder. Okay. These are so gay. <laughs> you should Ow! Be careful, be careful. Well, nice. Okay, so put awesome. it on top. Awesome. Really trying to There's your nice. favorite one with the cinnamon. Okay. Mm -hmm. I was watering. Can I eat some? Oh, well, let it cool a little bit. It's hot, but here we go with the um, with the custard, and so I think we're gonna let this cool off just a Where's little bit. Where's the spoon? Bit. I will get you a spoon. Please do, ma'am. One for you. Are you sure it's ready? Yes. Mmm. 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 That is actually delicious. Mmm. It <laughs> is like a meal. Isn't it? Yeah. And you don't feel guilty because it, I put a whole egg in it mm. and milk and it's mm. all good for you. Mmm. This one's mine, so you, you can get it. Okay, thank one. you. Mmm. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Oh. <laughs> mm. Thanks for watching Cooking In with Joyce Lynn and my special guest, Andy Dick, mm. who is enjoying his mm. custard. Mm. 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 I'm out. <laughs> <laughs> All right. He's out, but we're still here with our custard. I just wanted to say that 
I found out it's not really good to cook the bananas, so my next suggestion is just to make the custard and you can put your spices on top. But the bananas got kind of hard and chewy, so let's put the fresh fruit on afterwards. I'm just giving you that little handy hint. Thank you so much for joining us on Cooking In with Joyce Lynn and happy eating! Have you noticed that the word stressed backwards spells desserts? Stressed and desserts. So I'm going to say why desserts can be good for you if you have stress. Some of the things that are in desserts are chocolate. Chocolate, especially dark chocolate, has tons of antioxidants and polyphenols that will help you against some of your stresses. And you can use cinnamon. Cinnamon is a really strong antioxidant and we like to put that in our pie recipes. And nuts. These are some of almonds. Almonds are really good. Besides, have you noticed that when you're really stressed you could crunch on nuts? Nuts are protein filled and they have heart healthy uh, oils and no trans fats. And we have tons of different dried fruits. We have raisins and cranberries and these are even figs. If you chop those up and put them in some of your desserts, anything that we've already made, they can be put in the apple pie recipe. You can add this to toppings of the custards or even the pie filling. And lastly, the oatmeal. Oatmeal is really great because it's got protein. If you mix the oatmeal as a crunchy topping, that's going to give you protein and make it more nourishing. So all of these things added to your desserts will make your desserts more nutritious. And they actually add a bunch of flavor too. So I just wanted to give you some ideas on how you can help make your desserts better for your family and more delicious. I hope that helps and until next time, thanks for joining us on Cooking In with Joyce Lynn.